Hello, it's Sunday the 7th of February. Welcome to this quick update. Um, we're just above our house down there. Sounds is off in the distance. Uh, we've just brought Magnus out for a walk. He's disappeared into the um, into the woods there. We can't see him now, but anyway, not to worry. He's with us somewhere. But yeah, so Sunday the um, 7th of Feb, as I say. Uh, a, a quick update for you from the Italian government. Um, I think it was announced on Friday, or was it on Saturday's newspaper that we read? Friday. It Friday, it was announced Friday that as of the 15th of um, February, Italian ski resorts, as long as you are in the yellow zone, which I think, uh, well, certainly we are, and I think most of the uh, Italian resorts are now, um, as long as you're in the yellow zone, from the 15th of February, you can open. So uh, a glimmer of hope there for um, for, for skiing in uh, the Via Latia. We are still just waiting for confirmation from Via Latia as to what, if anything, will open. I think they're waiting to hear what assistance the, the government is going to give them um, as far as quotas, uh, how many ski passes they're able to sell. And once they have the quotas, I guess they'll work out whether it's going to be um, commercially viable to open. I don't, I don't know. Anyway, there's, there's lots to be sorted out still. But the government have said at least that um, they're given the green light. If we can get everything else in line, then the green light is, uh, is a, well, yeah, skiing is a go from the 15th of February. Obviously that doesn't help if you are in, uh, say for example, the UK, where I think there is still a travel ban in place until the 5th of March. Uh, however, uh, you know, if, if you can get yourselves over here after the 5th of March, then we might get some skiing towards the end of, uh, end of the season, which will be, uh, which will be great news. This week has been a bit of a, a bit of a strange week. We've uh, we did go up uh, ski touring uh, up into Sportinia, and uh, there's a bit of a video uh, about that coming up. So stay tuned if you want to see what it's like up in Sportinia at the moment. Uh, but it has been a bit of a strange one as far as the weather's concerned. As you can tell, it's a bit of an overcast day today. Uh, we've had rain, we've had wind, we've had snow, and we've had sand. Believe it or not, yesterday was it was like a Martian landscape. Um, it was very low cloud uh, but it had this orange hue to it and that was because a lot of sand got picked up from the Sahara and dumped over the Alps and it was uh, bizarre and absolutely uh, crazy well I mean we have seen it before but it, it was uh, more intense I think yesterday but uh, yeah some uh, it was almost like a Martian landscape it was uh, very very bizarre but um, good to see I guess but Sand isn't good for snow, but anyway. I woke up this morning, it was snowing. Uh, white stuff, not, not orangey red stuff, but actual white stuff. And uh, as I'm looking over towards Sousey, there is definitely snow up in the trees there. Um, so I think, um, I think we've had the, the last of the sandstorms. But um, yeah, so hopefully next week we've got some more snow coming in and colder temperatures. And uh, we're planning to go up to Jaffrau, which is uh, just behind Sinead there, over towards Badenecki. We're hoping to do that tomorrow, so um, we might bring some footage of that uh, in the next update. But that's it from me, I guess. Uh, is there anything else to say, love? I think we've... Um, no, nothing. <laughs> There's not much happening really, is there? But uh, hope you're all staying safe wherever you may be. And um, yeah. Oh, happy birthday to my sister for tomorrow. Oh, well, there we go. Happy birthday to Dee for tomorrow. Um, but yeah, that's it. So um, stay tuned for this, uh, for this video that we, sh we shot up the other day up in, uh, up in Sportinia. And we'll bring you another update as and when we have any more news. Here we are on Red 11. No, Red 29. Oh yes, not Red 11. We were just talking <laughs> about Red 11 because that's the way we might be skiing down. Red 29, favourite running Sousey? Favourite run. running Sousey. Here we are just coming into Sportinia. The Rocinera lift, the bottom of the Rocinera lift, and then through the trees we've got also the angle. The choke is going to be open. At home. Okay, so everything's closed up in Sportinia, so 
We're taking our skins off and we're going to ski down. Hopefully, um, it's Chow Pays. Are they expecting us now? Yeah, they are. Chow Pays are expecting us. Fantastic. We've run through. We've got some, uh, hopefully, some hot food waiting for us at Chow Pays.